Hello everybody, my name's Harry and today I've got something very special and exciting to show you and unbox. So I've got my unboxing knife here and it is in fact a new phone um, and it just happens to be the new iPhone 6s. I'm so excited to be opening this. Okay, so as you can see the plastic uh, cellophane is still on it. So this is a proper unboxing video. I'm going to start from the top and just cut through and then this bit I'm going to cut through if I can. There we go. And I'm just going to whip all of the plastic off. Okay, so here's the box. It's quite a nice box with the iPhone 6S and the butterfly or whatever the thing is. So here we go, first look at the phone and what do we get, oh I hate this, it takes too long, are you ready, there we go, so there she is, okay let's go ahead and lift her out and we'll just pop her aside for a second, I'm very excited um, and have a look at the, contact, uh, blah, 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 at the contents in the box. So what we have is the phone, uh, the iPhone tray which is just like that. Um, we have the little wallet which I'm just going to open and show you what's in there. Oh, we've got the SIM ejector tool. Um, we have these leaflets. We have the uh, sort of guide thing. Uh, iPhone information and the Apple stickers. Um, so yeah that's what's in the wallet basically. Nothing too exciting. Um, and I suppose, in fact, no, I need to, how am I supposed to get this back in here? Um, give me one second. Right, there we go, all back in the wallet. And I'm just going to put my shut and like this. So we have the ear pods, I think they're called, and should just open them. Um, how do you do this? Do you rip it or...? Ah. Right, I've found the little tab thing. Okay, so let's take that off and have a little look. Mm, very nice. I do also have a pair of these, so these will be just stay in the box so i've changed positions because earlier well not earlier a couple of minutes ago the connection went down there and i thought you know a bit of better lighting wouldn't uh, go amiss so i've popped this on charge my iphone 6s so there's the back and the front and i just want to point out look how i've set it up and everything and um it's i love it i think it's fantastic um and i just want to show you this touch second generation touch id look how fast that is i'm really oh, snapchat on. <laughs> um i just wanted to say how amazingly quick that was um this light. so i've set the 3d touch to um firm so i have to press a little bit harder so let me just try and focus on that so i have to push in a bit harder than normal because it's on firm but i really i think it's i think it's brilliant um, and obviously, let me just take a live photo and I can show you. So if we go on to here, this, so I've just taken a live photo and, um, here's what it does. Let me just focus in on the phone. Come on. Oh, is that the best we're going to get? So if I just take a live mode. photo and I can show you. So that is a live photo. So when you take the photo, um, it actually moves and also multitasking, you just, on the side here you just press and push and you can obviously clear these like that um, I will probably be doing a video soon um, on what's on my iPhone um, obviously about what's on my iPhone so yeah I think it's a brilliant phone and before I had the um, the 6 plus before this and to be honest with you it was too big um, in my view anyway but I mean I got on with, well with it first but sort of having it for 
a month or so it sort of started getting a bit impractical and um just too big I mean my it, fit, it did fit in my pockets but it was just a bit of a pain having it that big but um I think the smaller one is the perfect size for me and I'm really happy with my decision that I've made on this um I got it brand new from Argos um and it's fantastic 3D touch is superb a uh, second generation touch ID obviously as you've just seen and um obviously the um live wallpaper which is awesome and i also thought i would show you an app which is amazing um let me just so this app basically is a wallpaper app but lets you save live wallpapers so for instance this one whoa that really is out of focus so so this one is if you just press and hold it turns into a live background and you can save it to your gallery you just save it so I've just saved that like that what's this I'm just going to rate it right if then if I go oh, I'm just gonna go use this wallpaper and it gives me the option to set as a live wallpaper so if I put set on that and so look Oh, that's cool. I really like that. I think that's pretty cool. So yeah, that's uh, live wallpaper. Um, and obviously, I've covered in this video the 3D touch. Why is it not focusing? I know I thought I'd give you a little mention. Matthew and Jack, you're going to be excited for me to show you this and for you to have a go on the 3D touch. I'll have it plugged in right now because when I opened it, it only had 57%. And I have to say, it does charge quick. Um, I mean, it was on 57 about 10 minutes ago, now it's on 97, so it does charge very quick. Um, but all in all, amazing phone, just brilliant. I love Be it. sure to check out Jack Walker Vlogs, my friend, and um, <clears throat> watch his video, subscribe to him, um, and like his videos and watch them. And you know, he's got a great channel, I love all his videos, he's very fun and interactive with us, with you guys. and. Um, be sure to subscribe if you already haven't, like the video and comment down below what you think and if you liked me unboxing it. Um, if you like these types of videos, comment down below and I will do more of them. Um, not, I won't obviously just go out and buy an iPad Pro just to unbox it but um, you know, if I do ever buy a new phone or a new iPad or something like that, I will unbox it on camera if you like it. So do leave a comment and a like and subscribe if you already haven't and bye bye guys.